Good morning guys and welcome back to my channel. I am Ruby Roy and it is great to have you here. Um, welcome back to my perfectly imperfect life. Yes, my camera just shut off because <clears throat> the memory card was full of all those videos I've been filming but haven't posted. That is a qu very quick um, update. I quit my old job, got a new job in a construction office. I have celebrated my anniversary with Luke, we've been together four years. Um, I was struggling a lot with my mental health so I decided to quit social media so I've totally quit. The only reason I'm going to be going on is to post videos and that's going to be it. I'm not going to be scrolling through anything and to see anyone's updates or anything like that. But one thing I've learnt from getting off social media is that I would so much rather someone call me and be like I got engaged or like or like can we catch up for lunch and then tell me all their updates and I realized that like we're so used to seeing everyone's life being posted and updated all the time that we're constantly getting updates on their life so you don't have to talk to anyone you don't have to catch up with anyone because you're getting all the information and I would so much rather someone hang out with me or call me to tell me big news in their life or just to hang out. I'm trying a new method of foundation today using a brush. Wish me luck. Wish me luck. <laughs> I just tried my new foundation brush that I bought with you, Remy. Nice. I think it went go. I think it went good. It looks Stunning. good. Stunning. It looks good. Also got a whole big Morphe palette. Get excited. I'm always excited. Greetings like that, go. Greetings like that. What look should we go for today, Remy? I don't know what that means. <laughs> um, try and figure out what colours to do on my eyes, Remy. Oh my god, I have no idea. Like, there's so many to choose from. Like... <laughs> How am I supposed to make a decision? <laughs> I messed up because I just went and visited mum for like one minute and I took a long lead with Luna to the beach because mum and Griff live like right on the beach. And I was like, I'll take my camera. And I literally like got so distracted by like seeing them because I saw them for like one minute as I was at the car and about to go down to the beach that I got Luna all ready and went down and totally, ooh, totally forgot my camera, so that happened. <laughs> I am so out of practice with filming. It's actually ridiculous. Like, I'd, there's been like so many things I thought I was filming this morning and I hadn't even like pressed the record button or like it was already recording and then I stopped it when I pressed it. I thought I filmed something really funny between me and Luke. I thought I filmed something funny after that as well. And I didn't. I didn't film any of it, which is great. But yeah, I'm on my way home at the moment now. And I'm going to give Luna a bath. Because she's all sandy and she hasn't been feeling the best this week. Um, and been doing bad poos. So I want to clean her bum. <laughs> which is such a dog owner fucking lovely scenario and then not long after that i'm gonna have to go and get a haircut because that's booked at 1 30 and it's currently 12 and potentially also i don't think i'm gonna have time but i really need to wash my car um so i'll try and do that but yeah anyway see you later hey guys so once again i did not pick up the camera I went home after the beach, rushed around trying to get organized. Um, I bathed Luna and I also 
had lunch, sorry, just concentrating. Had some lunch, which is really good. Now I just ducked out and got my hair cut and it is so much shorter, but like it really needed it. My hair was so dead. Um, got some cards for dad, which are freaking hilarious. So it's dad's birthday tomorrow. And I bought three cards, not just for dad, but like the f cards there were just hilarious. So I went to the news agent in Budrum and it just like hit everything on the head. And I was just like, oh my God, this is so funny. <laughs> Oh my god, one of them, I was literally like, I'm gonna cack up in this store if I don't stop looking at it. Went to Coles and did the weirdest grocery shop I've ever done in my life. Because I needed Toblerone for dad and I needed a cabana for Luna for her training class tomorrow. So I literally got chocolate and sausage. Weirdest thing. But I am gonna keep picking up the camera this afternoon because there's a little bit on and... I don't know, it's a really nice day. I feel like filming it, even though I haven't been great at that already, and I'm sorry. <laughs> but I'll try. It's just been a very long time, and I think my confidence is gone, and I also think that I just, like I haven't been, you know, I keep doing things and don't think to pick up the camera, whereas like before I was really used to doing that. Sorry. <laughs> Hope this vlog turns out okay. But you guys keep moving too. I know it. I don't want to, you know, lose you guys. I didn't even show you my finished makeup. If you can see it, I kind of I'm just kind of drive and treat my makeup. But I made it like really warm colors, which I'm really not used to doing. And there's a bit more sparkle than usual as well. But I really liked it. Um, that palette was like, what is it? Like the 350 or 360 Supernatural palette. If you guys love nude makeup, it's such a good one. It's such a good palette. It's got a few shimmers in there, but like a lot of different neutral tones. And it's honestly, like I recommend it. And that Morphe foundation brush as well. I usually use a beauty blender for my foundation, but I've been seeing a lot of people using like a foundation brush and I was like, I should just give it a go. So I went to Mecca last weekend and that's where I got the palette and the um, makeup brush. I literally just got distracted then because I looked in my viewfinder screen thing for my camera and my fucking window is so dirty. <laughs> so it's two o'clock now and I have to meet mum at the dog park at three. So we'll be leaving in like half an hour or so. And I'm so excited. It's such a nice dog park, the one that we go to down that way. So I'm so excited to take Luna there again. And it's honestly the beautifulest day. Like it's clear blue skies, like a few tiny little clouds, 20 degrees, like not too hot, not too cold. Got a haircut. Wearing one of my favorite outfits. Oh, just feeling good right now. If I filmed a little bit more, I'd feel even better. But I just get so nervous now that I haven't done it in a while. And like, another thing I really need to work on is I get so nervous to film in my car. Like, like the camera is up on the dash right now and I feel so nervous. A, about you sliding around and distracting me while I'm driving. And B, because everyone can see the camera there. But, I want to do this and like, I really want to do this, so I really need to just man up and figure out how to, well, I just need to man up. That's the moral of the story. The other thing is I need to get more confident with filming in public because I can't just film myself going places and not actually at places. Like, it's just boring. So I do really need to get more confident. I am trying to work on it. I'm sorry, guys. It's just so, like, I don't, I don't like people looking at me weirdly, but this is another thing. I'm getting better with my mentality, guys, because I used to dress to what I thought the people I was meeting or the people I'd, that would be at the plaza or whatever. I used to dress to what other people would want me to wear. Lately, I'm so proud of myself. I've been dressing to exactly how I want to dress 
and what I feel confident in and I have felt so much better. So like some things I'm getting better at, but like give me a little bit of time, I'll get more confident with filming in public in time. It's just like, my camera's not huge, but it's not tiny. And I just, I don't know. It, I'm just still funny about it, all right? But um, I better hop off now and I will see you guys at home. Or the dog park, I don't know. I'll see. Later. I literally was gonna start filming probably like 10 minutes back down the road, but my camera flew off my dashboard when I turned around the corner. The camera flew off and like fell on my handbag and then I went around another corner and it swung off my handbag, which I thought it was in a stable position there swung off my handbag and slammed into my other thing and I was like oh my god if I just smashed my screen or something but you're fine we're here now um me and Luna Luna's literally just there um we're going to the dog park now so we might see Remy we might not it could just be me Luna mum Griff and Maggie oh my god you haven't met Maggie so mum and her partner Griff got a dog while I was off YouTube <laughs> Um, they rescued a like bitsa, so it's got heaps of different things in it. Such a nice dog park. I'm so excited. Luna, are you excited? There's so many ambulances around. Like I'm right next to a hospital, but like. Did you see me freak out about the camera? Yeah, I know you're at a different angle now. But you see me brum brum driving. Brum 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 brum. <laughs> What's wrong with me? God, I'm gonna get up, Mum and Griff. Oh, Remy's here. <laughs> I'm gonna get up all of them because Mum and Griff always are like, let's meet at three, right? And I'm like, sweet, I'll meet you there at three. And then I get here at three and they have been here for however long a time and then leave earlier than me and I'm like just rock up on time so we can leave at the same time <laughs> anyway I am going to go to the dog park and we'll see you there Good morning guys, I didn't like that. 